Come on, guys. We've been over this. I, I'm. It's not that I'm not flattered. I mean, I, I am, but you really don't need to make a skit about me. I'm not like all those other signs just soaking up the limelight. I mean, don't get me wrong. I have a very distinctive presence, but even just mentioning that I have this presence makes it a little less distinct. Uh, really, it's fine. I'd rather just... <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. We're, we're not party trick astrology, we're from MTV. MTV Cribs. We hear you have the softest blankets in all of Southern California. Why, well, yes. Yes, I do. do. Do you mind if we... Uh... Absolutely, come on in. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> now please, just sit down, make yourselves comfortable. Comfort is key. Comfort and relaxation is always what you need in any day, in any home, even if it's in a very specific, regimented, rigid, unchangeable way. Now, I'm sure you're very surprised at how wonderful and lovely my home is, um, considering that I haven't been really doing anything but working at a paper company for 25 years, but the key is save, 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 of course, I like to splurge on my little things. You know, I go out to a nice dinner with my family every Friday evening, and every Sunday I like to have brunch with the girls. But sometimes my kids, they ask on the way home from school, can we have McDonald's? And my answer always, always, always is no. Do you enjoy working at the paper company or do you ever get tired and wanna think about doing another job? No, no, no. I've never thought about doing another job. I guess I'm just very comfortable at the paper company. Besides, if I went somewhere else, then, you know, I, I wouldn't know what it would be like. You know, what if I didn't like it? And then I'd have to go find somewhere else. And then what if I didn't like that? No, no. It's just all too much stress. Besides, I really like touching the paper. Other things I like to touch, oh, you know, pillows, blankets, cold glasses that just came out of the fridge. <sighs> loofahs, loofahs with lots of scents on them. Loofahs that are just a little damp, dry loofahs. They're all very distinctive feelings, but each one has their own magic. This is my shoe collection. Um, they're not very many, but they're all very high quality. I only buy from one brand because that way I, I know my size and I know how the fit is and I know that my feet will be comfortable in the size. But the key is, technically I'm an eight and a half, but I go up to the full nine because then I can wear fuzzy socks. Are, um, are these your wedding photos? Yes, yes. Oh, that was such a nice time. Oh, let me take you through the lineup, show you who everyone is. Uh, that is Shelly. She was my childhood neighbor. We, we did our first lemonade stand together. Uh, she's quite the successful entrepreneurial lady now. We have dinner every once in a while, catch up every few weeks, week or so, uh, and just talk about literature and French cuisine. She's really quite a lady. Um, here we have Rebecca. Rebecca, Rebecca, Rebecca. She was my twin in my first ever middle, middle school uh, twin day for Spirit Week. Us, oh, we... <laughs> You don't want to catch us on Rodeo Drive together. So much damage is done. <laughs> and oh, this here is Kellyanne. She was my best friend in college. Well, best friend for life, really. She's she's a bit of a bit of a wild one, you know. She's a Scorpio. I've never told anyone this, but she actually convinced me 
to tattoo her initials on my butt. And I did it. She was always getting me out of my comfort zone. She, uh, she had the softest lips, too. Um, what? Uh, <laughs> your, your sister, your sister, was she in, in your wedding, too? Camilla? No. No, 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 no. I don't like to talk about Camilla. So she wasn't. No. She stole my date for the junior prom. My own sister. No, I haven't talked to her since. Even when you still live together? I haven't talked to her since. So what are your goals and aspirations? Hmm. Well, I guess once I get to that certain age, I want to make sure that my kids are going to nice, pristine colleges. And then I guess I dip into my savings. Me and my husband would move out to a nice, quiet beach town and, I don't know, maybe start a, an aroma therapy candle line, but not for the money of it. Just for the sake of having a nice, relaxing hobby. Well, that sounds lovely. Yes, yes, well. This was very nice, but my kids are coming home from their play date in four hours, and I need to have a bath. So. Oh, in four in four hours. Yes, oh, uh, um. bye bye now. Wait, but we we still have a few more. No, no, really. Uh, oh. It was nice chatting to you, but okay. Um, have a nice one and take care. Well then.